So this is a sharper image sound soother. Yeah. So I picked this up at a garage sale a while back. And as soon as I saw it, I grabbed it because I thought it was a Proton 320 or something. Which if you've never seen a Proton 320, they look almost identical. And the sound quality is excellent on those radios. And this one as well. And then I grabbed it and I looked at it and I go, oh, sharper image. What? Never seen this before. Never heard of it. I've heard of Sharper Image, but I didn't know they made these radios. So you get on the internet and you look. Sure enough, Sharper Image uh, sound soothers all over eBay, but none like this. This is almost, you know, I Googled it. I looked on eBay. There's nothing this model. So if you look on the bottom, model SM241. And there's really not a lot of information down here, but it does what I suspect is a date code of 1991. Um, about the same time they were making the Proton radios and Nakamichi radios that look the same. And you can see it says made for, oh, somewhere it says made for. Oh, I don't even see it now. It says made for a uh, sharper image. I don't remember where I saw that. Yeah, well, exclusively for sharper image. So obviously sharper image didn't make these radios. They probably had somebody like uh, Proton make them for them, and then they just put their own label on them. But here, another great example. Look on the top. So this is how you set the time. You get your alarm button, alarm two time. And then that's how you set, you hold down on the alarm button and then you just push the arrow to set the time or the alarm. That's all these buttons are for. And this is audio on off. Of course you have the snooze button. Uh, what is that button? Alarm button. Does have separate treble and bass knobs. They're really small, and if you have big fingers like me, they're kind of hard to churn. And also up here you have, these are like slider buttons. Switches from AM to FM. Like I said, this is a sound soother, so it has a couple different sounds. It has uh, white noise, and it has waves. And then, what is this? This is the alarm buttons on or off. Oops, sorry. So, anyways, really nice radio. It has a photo cell. The photo cell is right here, so, you know, at night when you turn off the light, the numbers will get darker. I don't know if you can see that. I'm putting my finger over it. It's not making much of a difference right now. The dial is not illuminated. I don't see a light bulb in there or anything. I looked. I tipped it. There's an indicator down here. It tells you when your radio is on. Let's turn this down. Turn the radio on. The light comes on. Same with the sound soother. See? The light comes on. Turn it on. Let's listen to some soothing sounds. And you can kind of see what that... I'll turn it on, and it has a separate volume dial for the soothing sound, and then a separate uh, volume dial for the radio. So it's on. That is the white noise soothing sound. So on the back, there's a switch. White noise or waves. Let's switch it to waves. So basically what that wh white noise is just basically static to me. Let's turn it on waves. There you go, a little wave action. So it's basically white noise getting louder and quieter. 
and then turn it off. So that's it. You won't find another one like this. I found no records of it on Google. You can't find a manual for it. There hasn't been any on eBay. I finally sold this thing. I had it on eBay for quite a while. Somebody just bought it. I had to keep reducing my price because nobody's ever heard of one. But the sound quality is really good. Turn the radio on. Minnesota's classic rock, 92 KQRS. That's it for me today. Peace. Thank you, as always, for being Trouble. here with us. We appreciate that you listen to KQ. And that's it. I'll see you tomorrow. Here's some Led Zepp. Have a good one. Nice radio. If you find one, which you won't, uh, buy it. Great sound quality. Not the same price tag as a Protons, so I'd go for it.